Well, given the time of year and the fact most sports are now winding down for the Christmas and New Year break, most of our look ahead, in fact, involves looking back. Over the last few days, the Tercentenary Hall has been the venue of a host of Junior Basketball Cup Finals. On Tuesday, Bavaria Blue Stars lifted the Under-14 Cup with a victory over Lincoln Bayside. Yesterday, Blue Stars won the Under-12s, the Soldiers won the Under-15s, and completing the sweep of uh, age groups this afternoon in the under-13s final, soldiers took on Lincoln Bayside. Uh, to football, and last night, Lincoln Redimps laboured to a 2-0 victory over Manchester 62 to wrap up the first round of fixtures of the Gibraltar National League. It now splits into two halves for the second round in 2020. Lincoln seemingly out of the title race now in third position. They trail table toppers Europa by four points. Earlier this week, the Imps parted ways with head coach Victor Afonso, with under-23s coach Malcolm Martin stepping in on a temporary basis. At staying with the sport, and it all seems to have gone pear-shaped for Monsgalpe. For weeks and weeks, they looked like the most likely of the mid-table sides to make it into the top half uh, for the mid-season split. But defeat on Tuesday, followed by a massive win for Lions on the same night, saw the Tangerines edge the right side of the split. As if that wasn't bad enough, further reports stemming from the Monsgalpe camp of unrest amongst the squad, with several players speaking out over unpaid wages. Moving indoors now and in the last round of futsal fixtures before the Christmas break, there are a few crackers to look forward to. Tomorrow afternoon, bitter rivals Bavaria and South go head to head. College 1975 and Montgalpe clash, both in contention for a favourable split. Saturday evening, it's second versus fourth as Spartans take on Europa, just three points separate the sides. Then on Sunday, Koala face Laguna. And rounding up the weekend, Inter Principia second from bottom, We'll be hoping for a bit of a miracle as they take on league leaders, Lynx.